Jive talking. Bam, 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 bam. Jive talking. Bam, 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 bam. This is it. Yeah, this is it. Really went past it. So guys, welcome back to the channel once again. Touching down from the super duper Chiang Mai city in Northern Thailand as always. Today I'm out and about and I'm gonna show you another little gem. Gonna show you a new clove store that I found in the last couple of months. And in, in the big stores in Thailand, I find like the cloves are crap. The little shops on the side of the road are the ones that sell the best cloves. The best old makes and the best, you know, stuff from back in the day. If anybody likes the retro stuff like I do. I've just stopped off at this cool restaurant here and I'm gonna get some pork and some beef for 35 baht. Can't go wrong there, eh guys? Show you a bit of Lampoon Road a minute. So there's the Holiday Inn there where I come over the bridge normally. So I'm only just down a bit from there. And the clove shop that I'm gonna show you is just about five minutes down this road before you get to the big, the big junction at the highway. It's just on the left side here. And I'm gonna show you that. Look at this for a truck. Oh, I missed it. Had like massive colors on the front and loads of stuff on the front. Missed it, man. This has stopped off in here. One of your average side of the road food stores. These places are everywhere in Thailand. I'll show you the menu. Um, they have got it in English as well, but basically it's just um, like fish balls and pork balls, beef balls. Got your noodles up there as well, like everybody sells. And you get your free water, as always. Oh, and you get your free sides on here. I've got some beef today. Just another day in paradise. Somebody's got to do it, ain't they? Somebody's got to do it. Mm. Beef. It's always good to have beef. Completed it, mate. Completed it. Easy. That was very nice. 35 baht. Nice bit of beef and a bit of pork in there as well. It's a good little place, this. Gonna come back here again, I think. Two nice sisters running the place very friendly ah lovely jubbly rodders that's me belly full for another morning that'll do me till afternoon where i'll have some snacks so I'll just show you what's around here never been in here before another nice little place here right at the end this lady don't get so many customers i doubt it because you have to come right to the end of this road here always places to get food in Chiang Mai man wherever you go that's why I love it because you can just stop anywhere no matter where you are out in the wilderness somebody will be selling some grub somewhere for a decent price as well so we're gonna head off to this cool new clothes store I'm gonna show you around leave the location you know the drill people you know the drill Jive talking, bam 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 bam. Jive talking, bam 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 bam. This it, yeah, this is it. Nearly went past it. This is the cool new retro store I found. If anybody wants to translate that, be my guest. So it was literally just 30 seconds where I just got some food. I thought it was a little bit further down than that, but yeah, it's just past the Holiday Inn, really, over the bridge turn right holiday in come down a few few minutes and you're at this cool clothing store yeah they got the checkered shirts and all that got the t-shirts starting from 20 baht i'll just show you a look around in a minute look they got loads and loads of it i only found this place like a couple months ago and they got all your shirts shorts trousers shoes give you a look around
got all these quick drying t-shirts look 50 baht each costs you 200 baht in a shop LA Galaxy they got loads got 20 baht over there we got another another full bin of hats I mean if you got a bowed head like me everybody needs a hat in Thailand you know so, and most of it is like old and been used but, but it's worth coming in places like this just to have a look and you always come across a gem or if you want shorts or anything like that these are the places to come shorts or stuff for working out you can get all your shorts here all your tracksuit bottoms you can get all your basketball tops as well all for cheap good price get your football tops you can find like Chelsea and Liverpool Man United in here most of them are knockoffs, but who cares when you're in Thailand, right? Yeah, there's a Chelsea one there. Chelsea, you can tell it's knockoff, but yeah, 150 baht. It's always worth a look. Couldn't find nothing in there today that I wanted really, but it's always good to know and another good place to show you people. It's, um, clothes are Clothes are a hard thing to get when you come to Thailand for certain people. It depends what you wear. Everybody wears different, right? Different styles and different sizes. And I truly believe these places on the sides of the road are, are some of the best places to get clothes and shorts and lightweight t-shirts in Thailand. There's some t-shirts in there now more expensive than, than say Decathlon or down Tesco or something. But sometimes it's worth it if it's something that you want. I mean, when I first come here, I used to buy stuff I didn't really like but that's all you could get you can find stuff down the market for cheap and haggle a bit more but these places are always worth a rummage whereas all gummage so just another little place guys i will pin this place on the location as always and another little gem for anybody wanting to come to chiang mai and they need some new trainers new t-shirt new pair of shorts because you always ruin clothes in thailand no matter what you bring here after a while the sweat and the dirt and the grime it'll get ruined all all the stuff i brought with me is either stretched ruined or stained up and a lot of places don't do hot water wash here it's all cold water wash so if you get like a real deep bad stain it's hard to get it out in thailand unless you you can get hot water washes here but most of the apartments and the rooms it's just a cold water wash and it, it cleans your clothes all right but like i said if you got a if you got a deep stain then it's hard to get out yeah it's just a just another little place guys this is one of the best clothes shops i've found actually i've shown you a few now but i would really recommend this one ah back on a quieter road now lovely day again in chiang mai beautiful weather now yeah the vlogs hope the vlogs are not too noisy this mic's a very noisy mic i was thinking of getting a new mic that cuts out cuts out the background noise but i like all that i like when you can hear everything going on around you traffic and everything but it's you guys that matter so i just wanted to ask you like do you prefer cutting out the background noise or do you like to hear everything that's going on around the city i mean i prefer that i prefer to hear everything going on even if it's overpowering sometimes just wanted to show you this place again this old derelict mansion place i don't know what it was maybe somebody can tell me but they they fenced it all off now in the last couple of weeks they've put up this metal fence because all this was open i i don't know what it used to be it's a big old place it's all falling down and there's families living in there and they've put up all this so it looks like they're gonna start start some work on it maybe knock it down or re redo it and make it into something i don't know 
I will keep up to date with it and let people know and we'll do some updates on it whenever I come down here. All right, anything coming? No. Nice little area down this way. This is down near the Guam Im vegetarian shop. Police are out. What's going on down here then? Seems a bit busy down here. Something going on. Let's get through it quick. Uh -huh. Something happening. Let's get out of it. So we're going to cut down near Guam Im. Jav talking. Bound, 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 bound. This is the famous Guam Im. Takeaway only. They've sealed it all off. Sealed it all off, man. So they didn't have my business today. I went elsewhere. Got some noodles, didn't I? Jav talking. I've got the Bee Gees in my head all morning. I'd drive talking on <laughs> when I was in the shower. Now I can't stop singing it. It's all about having a laugh in it. I don't take myself too seriously doing the vlogging. What becomes of it becomes of it. I just like having a laugh, chilling, roaming around. Oh, I'm happy like that, you know. Right, getting up to the highway now. So I'm gonna love you and leave you for this vlog, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. It was just a little one showing you a new cool clothing store. Always comes in handy, right? Comes in handy for anybody that comes here wanting a pair of shorts or swimming trunks or something just to chill out in and you, you, your clothes get ruined here anyway. So there's, there's no point keep spending, spending, spending when you've got all these great shops around the city on the side of the road like this. Anyway, I'm going to stop waffling as always. Get back home for my coffee and chill out for the rest of the day. And I will see you all in the next one, people. So take it easy, man. Take it easy.